How's it going guys? It's Root Junkie here and in today's video we're going to be unboxing my brand new Panasonic Lumix G camera 4K baby. Let's go do this. Here it is, my brand new camera here for 2017, the Panasonic Lumix G. Uh, this is the G85 and we're gonna be shooting in 4K. So this video you're watching right now, currently on my Canon T3i right there, T5i, I should say, um, is gonna be the last one in, in 1080, 1080p we're moving to 4K. So I figured just for fun, I'd go ahead and unbox this uh, device for you guys and uh, just show it to you. So I'm excited to start shooting on this kind of a camera. So you can see it tells you some, this is actually kind of cool. It's a really good idea and it makes sense. They show you different things you should buy, accessories for this camera. And this one right here, which is the extended battery uh, compartment and handle, I will probably get. I have it on my Canon above me here. And definitely probably pick that one up. Maybe some of the ex extra batteries and so on. So we're going to open it up. You've got your manual and all of your paperwork right there. Open this up. And I did go ahead and get the kit lens. Um, and really the main reason for that is just because these lenses are a little bit different than my Canon camera and I'm waiting for my adapter. And so in the meantime, I figured I might as well get the kit lens right here. So this is a 12 to 60 uh, millimeter lens. So very interesting. I wonder what the f-stop is on this. I don't even know. I didn't even look. I just figured I'd buy the kit lens because it came with it. So we've got that right there. I'll set it to the side. There's a little hood for the lens. So I actually like these hoods. I think they um, just make your camera look a lot cooler when you put the hood on the, on the lens. So we've got that. Next is the camera body right here. So we'll open it up and there you go. Now it's funny because it actually looks kind of small. We're gonna take a closer look at that in a second. It looks small to me. I'm so used to having that extended battery. So we got a strap. And otherwise, we've got what's in this last little container here, which looks like your battery and your cables. So, oh, there's your battery right down there in the bottom. Battery, so that's everything in the box. Let's take that away. And let's go ahead and take a better look here at some parts. There we go. So here we've got a battery. What kind of information do we have on this? It's a 1200 milliamp hour battery. There you go, 7.2 volts. So that is the battery right there. Um, looks like we have a standard USB to micro USB cable. We have your charging brick right here. So this is actually kind of cool and I, I like this, I dig this a lot. Check that out right there. That is cool, right into the wall. So I'm wondering if they have an adapter, I'm gonna have to look into that and see if they have adapters so I can actually leave this plugged in sitting like this on my desk. That's how I have my Canon. So um, I'll have to look into that, see if they got an adapter for it. Maybe just a different style charger, but still really cool. Plug right into the wall, put your battery right in there and uh, you'll be charging up. So not bad at all, I like that. Probably be picking up some extra batteries too. And yeah, that body, wow, that just looks small to me. But you know what, let's get down here and take a closer look at the camera body itself. So here you go, there is the camera body. Um, obviously you've got the little lens cover, so you got the release button here in the front. You can pull off the uh, lens, so that's pretty sweet, and put on your lens like this. Now, I'm planning on getting a wicked awesome lens for this, uh, a Sigma lens, and I'll put that on as soon as I get it, and I'm planning on shooting with that, so that's going to be really cool. Um, here we go, red dot to red dot. Chaboom. There you go. So yeah, that's actually really sleek looking. Wow. Wow. Kind of surprising. I, I'm so used to my uh, Canon that's quite a bit bit bigger uh, camera body. So, But on the back you do have your uh, LCD right here fold out. It does pivot as you can see which is excellent. Um, my Canon does that too. Here it says Wi-Fi so I'm going to be playing with that. I think you can install an application on your phone and then um, you can use your phone to control your camera. So that's really cool. Um, otherwise, you got a D-pad, standard stuff, little play button for playing videos, some uh, autofocus things right up there, little spinner up here, your on-off switch, 
Another little dial. Not sure what all this does yet because uh, this is new for me. Like I said, I've been a big Canon guy, so I know their interface really well. Looks like a record button. Obviously, your camera. Some other modes you can do over here. 4K. There we go. Very cool. Flash. Ooh, check that out. It'll pop that up right there. Set that back down. You do have a hot foot here, which is obviously uh, necessary for a lot of features and the microphones and stuff. It does have this little cover case, a little cover piece on it, so that's kind of nice. I like that. I don't think my Canon had that. Um, otherwise, on the side, what else do we got here? So you have a remote in, a mic in, if you want to use a uh, mic accessory. And then you have HDMI and USB. So you can hook up your camera directly to your computer. Um, and then over here, we have SD card slot. So standard uh, SD card will go in there. So I'm going to be getting uh, probably 64 gig, I'm thinking. Maybe bigger, I don't know. What do you guys think? I'm not shot in 4K. I'm not sure how much it takes up on your device but other than that you've got your bay door down here in the bottom you can flip open put your battery in lock that again looks like you've got interesting a hole huh i am not sure what that does or how that functions but that is interesting i'm gonna have to look into that that's really interesting maybe that's for adding your accessory foot on which gives you your handle on this side um not sure I'm going to have to play with that. That's, yeah, that's got me uh, wondering. Obviously, you got your foot right here if you want to put on a mount. You have, ooh, I'm not sure what that is either. That's that's a connection port right there for something. You guys see that? It's all gold. Yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna have to do some reading because this is new for me. Definitely new. But I'm really looking forward to shooting in 4K. Um, this year, that's, that's kind of my plan. So really digging it. Look at that. <laughs> that's kind of funny looks like an oreo so yeah really looking forward to that hope you guys are looking forward to seeing some footage in 4k um i'm i'm I, that's what i'm planning to do on the channel this year so whole, whole bunch of new content coming for you guys this year on this camera but it's probably going to have a lens that's bigger than the camera it's going to be like something like that on the sucker so it's going to shoot some uh some good stuff so look forward to that hope you guys are too add some more accessories to this thing and learn how to do some shooting with it and uh, i'm pretty pumped pretty pumped about this year uh, so stay tuned to the channel and uh, it's gonna wrap it up for me this quick kind of unboxing here of my brand new camera and uh we'll catch you guys in the next video in 4k catch you guys later root junkie out